Hello, Charles from American Life 365. In this video, I will share with you how to overwinter peppers. I only use peppers as an example, as we do other perennials. Let's take a look at these four or five years old peppers. Even in winter, they still produce quite a lot of peppers. The stems are large and strong. This pepper grows in the ground, and this pepper grows in a big pot. Stems and branches are bigger and stronger. Very well. How did I grow these peppers so well? Let me share a couple points to overwinter peppers. The number one point is, if possible, you had better leave the peppers outside for overwinter. This is the opposite way. Most、uh, perennial plants produce something such as、uh, peppers, eggplants, squash, etc., which do require chill hours. I have a video about chill hours. You can check it through the link in the video's comments. Enough chill hours is essential for. Perennial plants to produce more. If you don't give perennial enough chill hours, they won't take root well. In the next few years, may not produce more. Chili peppers may not be able to produce or withstand more, or produce too small peppers. There are many videos. Telling us to move perennial plants indoors. Of course, on coldest days, and you have no choice but to move indoors. But if you are in area like us, which is not too cold, the coldest days is about ice. You can leave the perennial plants outside. To overwinter, let your perennial plants enjoy the coldest days, which is chill hours. My second point is, outdoors are the most ideal growth environment for perennial plants. Strong sunlight and strong wind can maintain photosynthesis, absorb nutrients. And help root growth. Having nature enemies helps control pests and disease in the soil. If we bring perennial indoors, we basically take away the sun and the wind. The worst part is to drive the pests enemies out of the plants, which makes pests. And disease a paradise. The third point is find the warmest place in your yard and move the perennials to the warmest place. The warmest place are usually the place with the most sunlight and the least wind. From the picture, you can find. Temperature in different places can have more than ten degrees differences. So we grow our peppers in the warmest place. My fourth point is: if your area is too cold, you can cover them at night, or use a wrap or rope to tidy it up. So these protective approaches can protect this 
perennials over winter. The fifth point is continue watering annual plants. You may water it at the warmest time a day. The last point is prune unnecessary weak branches and to save nutrition and energies. If you take these points in consideration, you can make your annual plants over winter and produce more in the incoming year. We have hundreds of videos in many aspects of American life. If you like our video, please click the logo to subscribe our channel and share with your friends. Your effort to help us encourage us to make more videos. Thank you.